Hey y'all, hey, so I wanted to do a quick video in a series of using your stash. So I did receive this um, daily pad in my treasure chest subscription. Ooh, I can't remember if this was Q3 or if this was Q4. As you can see, I have been using it. I actually have been using this for multiple ways. One of the ways that I am using this is for meal prepping. So you can obviously just write in breakfast, lunch, and dinner, but because I am in the spirit of using the things, I pulled out a Gold Mine and Cocoa Planner Girl sticker book. This was from, I was hoping the year was on here, but this is an older sticker book. I don't believe that this one is available anymore, but I will um, put a link to Gold Mine and Coco. I believe that there are some extra, actually this um, desk pad is available separately. She did offer it a la carte, the, um, the monthly and the weekly. So I came across these stickers and I was like, you know what? I need to do meal plan for the week. So I said these would be good because y'all know one I love me some lines so I said we can use all the things and dress this up a little bit so I can kind of get a two for one so you guys know I've been talking about uh, the 12 week plan so my health 12 week plan goal is to drop 30 pounds in the next 12 weeks. So with that comes making sure I am not snacking and that I am getting enough exercise. So I lost I lost a, a nice amount of weight before and then life started life and, and it and I ended up putting quite a few pounds back on. So when I was doing my best, I very much um when the weight was kind of coming off consistently and at a not necessarily a rapid pace, but like an even pace. I was meal planning. I was making smoothies in um, the beginning. I had cut down on my meat intake. I was walking um, four to five miles every day. I was also including some exercise videos in between. So I am very much on the path of getting back to that. For me, um, my son passed. Um, it's been a year. So like the walking the neighborhood thing and like the the route that I used to walk we used to walk together so there are some days where it is a little bit triggering for me so I am still trying to work past that so I'm trying to decide if I'm going to keep trying to muscle through it in the morning or if I'm just going to start walking in the afternoon or in the evening or maybe changing the route. It's hard because everything around, you know, the neighborhood and everything kind of reminds me of my son. But so the biggest thing for me is getting back into um, meal prepping. So we are going to go back to smoothies in the morning. So alternating, doing, not necessarily drinking a smoothie every day, but what I was doing was every other day, Friday and Saturdays were the days that I actually cooked breakfast because I cook breakfast for my whole family. During the week, I'm not cooking breakfast. Um, and then on Fridays, I got into the point where me and my partner was ordering like damn burritos and I was like no so that <laughs> we are cutting out and then I was doing between boiled eggs and avocado 
Now, all last week I was doing boiled eggs, so we are going to mix that up. I did buy some dairy-free yogurt. So it's going to be yogurt and a bagel, smoothies, and then Thursday I'll do the boiled egg and my avocado. For lunch, I'm going to do... These are all going to be mixes of salad. So this is going to be my Greek salad. I already made that this morning. And then I'm just going to be do a salad with turkey on top. And then oh, I'm going to do cucumber. Mm. And tomato and olive salad Friday oh so breakfast this is usually pancakes and eggs that's Saturday and Sunday and I'll probably do waffles on Sunday because I bought this um, cinnamon uh, cinnamon roll pancake and pancake mix. I think I'm gonna make waffles with it versus um, versus making um, pancakes with it. Where was I at lunch? Well, Friday I'm gonna have lo mein because I'm actually going out for lunch. I'm gonna meet up with one of my coworkers. And then we are going to have, I got turkey lunch meat, so I need to use it. I'm just going to make a turkey sandwich. Mm, yep. I'm going to make a turkey sandwich. And then lunch is going to be leftovers. I don't know what I'm going to have for lunch on Sunday. We'll come back to that one. So then for dinner, it's going to be shrimp ravioli. Um, Tuesday, we are going to have, I'm going to have taco salad. Because I'm going to make tacos for my oldest kid. And then well, Wednesday, is going to be leftovers. I'll do because I'm sure we'll have leftover ravioli and then Thursday I'm gonna do rice with chicken breast I already have the chicken breast marinated and then Friday I'm gonna take that same whatever leftover chicken we had and I'm gonna make stir-fry Saturday, me and the man are going out to eat. And then Sunday, I'm going to make jerk chicken. Because one of my girlfriends asked for jerk chicken, so I'm going to make hers and I'm going to make ours. Saturday, I'm going to put leftovers because usually we always have leftovers anytime we go to eat out. Um, Top priorities. I don't want to write no sugar. I was starting to write no sugar, but what we can write is no dairy. We are doing good with that and cut back on sugar and then snacks. I have almonds. I'm trying to think what else do I have down there to actually snack on. I think that's all I have is almonds. Oh man. Um and then grocery list for March. I had that's what I need to make sure I I, I buy. Um some snacks because I I say almonds is the only thing that I really have down there to Munch on. Okay. So, that's my meal plan for the week. Now, I will take this off. 
and I will actually stick this on the refrigerator. Anything else that comes up that I may need for grocery wise, I can use in that box that says next week. Here we go to buy. Because I already know offhand I need black olives. I can write that down. I know I need them. And for right now, that's all I can think of that I need offhand. But this is one of the ways that I am using my weekly desk pad. So thanks for guys for watching. It's a short sweet. Hope this gave you some ideas and tips and tricks on how to use this desk pad or how to use any weekly desk pad. And just in showing you how some people meal plan. This is an impromptu meal plan. But thanks you guys for watching. Peace and blessings to you all. Thank you.